It seems like a harmless game. You give and expect gifts, but these secret Santa and sister exchanges are actually pyramid schemes. Mallory Sofistai tells us, so you won't receive a return on your investment and you're giving up something else as we count down the 12 scams of Christmas. They go by a number of names, Secret Santa, Secret Sister, Holiday Wine Exchange, The Blessing Loom. No matter the name, know that these schemes are illegal and cost you more than you think. A way to brighten someone's day, receive a little something in return, and the Secret Sister gift exchange doesn't require a huge buy-in. I'm running the risk that if I give somebody a dollar, uh, the, the last two or three people on that list are going to give me a dollar. That's, the, you know, a really simplified version of it. But Angie Barnett with the Better Business Bureau said you likely won't receive anything and are giving away your personal information. These schemes, however, can become costly when more money is involved, like with the Blessing Loom or Cash App Circle. People were receiving notifications that all they had to do was invest $500 to get $5,000. Participants would load up prepaid cards, then wait for their investment to grow. Money is to be made by those at the top. And the further out the circle goes, when I bring in friends to invest and then they bring in friends, the money dries up. There's not enough money to support that large group. And the pyramid literally collapses. Barnett said these online scams became more prevalent right as the pandemic hit. People were losing money at a time when they could not afford to do so. In addition to being a poor investment, these schemes are illegal. The U.S. Postal Inspection Services considers it a form of gambling. It's also illegal to mail alcohol via USPS. So if you receive one of these invitations, just ignore it or report it on the social media platform. With your 12 Scams of Christmas, I'm Mallory Safost.